Hey, Talon here. If you've seen the landing page of Prime Design System Kit, you already noticed that the hero section includes subtle isometric illustrations. They were made purely in Figma. Today I would like to show you how to achieve this isometric effect in a few easy steps. Let's get started. Okay, right in Figma, I already have this kind of isometric grid. We will use that to align our element. Let's draw a rectangle, add a bit of radius to it. Fine. And achieving isometric effect is super easy thanks to some plugins. For the purpose of this tutorial, I used Fast Isometric. It's very handy because it allows you to align the element in a way you want very quickly. I think that this will be perfect for our purpose. We have our shape. It's isometric already, but we want to add this kind of subtle 3D effect. This is achieved thanks to illusion of lighting. Let's imagine that light goes from here and analyze the object that way. First, let's try to create this kind of effect with a kind of gradient. It's very subtle, so the differences between colors are not that dramatic. Okay. Our object will obviously cast the shadow, drop shadow, so let's add that effect. Make it look more elegant. Let's increase a bit distance and reduce opacity. Looks already nice. Since the light is cast from here, these edges will have a little bit of highlight here and this one will cast more shadow. Let's achieve that effect with inner shadow. Let's reduce opacity. Let's increase the blur. And yeah, let's decrease opacity a bit more. Okay, that looks nice. And let's add another inner shadow, but in opposite direction to add a bit of light. So we have to turn this color into white or light one. Uh, for this one, we will increase opacity. And yeah, it's ready. Very simple, easy trick, and it creates illusion of 3D isometric effect. You may play with that a little bit more reduce the fill and add another effect like background blur increase it and decrease it a bit more and maybe decrease this a little bit more and you have even this nice glass morphic 3d effect that's it Leave a comment if you would like to see more tutorials like this. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the channel to get more tips like this. And see you soon.